what's up y'all welcome back to my channel on behalf of Britt. if you're new here welcome i'm Brittany. today is a working day i've already had two appointments today and i'm about to do my final appointment and i decided let me just go ahead and do a brighter vlog we're going to do some holiday appointments with it being christmas season i have quite a bit of people coming so i said let me do one in the beginning of the month and possibly one closer to christmas to show y'all all of the cute styles my clients are coming up with for the month of December. My clients are trying new things. They're hitting me up about different hair they want to try. And I said, okay, so let's get a vlog going. Today is Saturday, by the way. It is December 3rd. I think it's December 3rd. I'm going to make a hair store run in this vlog. So there will be some of that. I need a bunch of Christmas bows for the whole month of December. I just want to make sure I'm racked up when the girls come and their moms are requesting red beads, red and gold, red and silver, green and red, all of that. I want to make sure I have it. Um, and I also want to mention that there will be a giveaway soon. Um, I was supposed to do a giveaway when I reached 2,000 subscribers and around that time I got COVID and I got behind on my videos and everything and I never just got caught up. So I said when I reached 2,500 um i would do a giveaway and we're almost there which is it, it's in the month of december so it's the perfect time for me to do a christmas slash 2500 giveaway all in one so i'm gonna do like a giveaway gift to someone special and i'll insert the names into a raffle and uh pull the name like that but towards the end of this month i will be gifting a subscriber something special so definitely continue to show me love it doesn't matter if you've been around a while or if you're new um if i see that you're messing with me I'm going to give you a gift because you definitely don't have to support and all of y'all have been. So thank you, thank you, thank you for that. But yeah, y'all, this will be a braided vlog. I'm about to do my client Corinne's hair um, and that'll wrap up today. And then we'll get into some more appointments this weekend and so on and so forth. But <laughs> welcome to another braided vlog, a holiday edition. My client Jazz just left and she brought me this immune blend drink. Hold on, let me cut the TV down. I need to shake up the drink too. Um, but it's an immune blend drink by this company called Tori Tonics. It's like a holistic nutritionist lady that she goes to. It has sour sop in it, coconut, ginger, limes, cane sugar. Um, so I'm going to drink this down. I just needed something that's going to help settle my stomach around cycle time and kind of just flesh me out. So I'm going to try this. And if I fall in love with it, I'll start shopping with her on my own. Excuse my nails, y'all. It's time for a fill-in. But I just wanted to say shout out to Jazz. Thank you, Jazz. And put y'all on this drink because if I like it, I definitely want to put on another black-owned business. So, yeah, this is her Instagram your vitamin lady underscore 101 her phone number she has a store location in um atlanta and a bag like this is five dollars you get six for 25 dollars. so i'm gonna try this flavor jazz says this is one of the best i look full and i still haven't eaten anything today so i'm not gonna drink this bag down i kind of want to drink it with food but i want to try it for y'all it's not that bad you can taste the ginger. That's the very first thing I taste. But y'all know ginger or turmeric, anything like that is going to be super strong in a drink anyway. But it's not unbearable. This is a good drink. This is a really good drink. Picking up dinner from my favorite Japanese spot. Can y'all guess where I am? Look straight ahead. Did you guess it? Just picking up my food. I already ordered it. I'm not going to dine in. It's been a long day with hair. <laughs> Thank you. 
dinner. I ran out to the store and the store that I went to was all sold out of mango and lime bread and wax. So I just got this super large braiders gel by BTL. And so this along with my other mango and lime jars should be enough to get me through until that big hair store haul that I plan on doing soon. And then I was grabbing some things out of my trunk and realized my Crocs was still in the trunk. My dad recently brought me some Crocs to work in because all of the Crocs that I have, which are awesome to work in, are have the little holes in them where if I'm spraying my client's hair, just doing different things that requires a uh, liquid, it can get through to my feet and I needed like a full, I needed full coverage. So he got me just the, y'all, it ain't no fashion to it, nothing sp um, special about it. It just has the arch support for my feet, which is really good for me to work in. Closed toe, you see a lot of people wear them in hospitals. I preach to y'all about comfortable shoes, footwear. I need to talk to y'all about comfortable clothing, but I've talked to y'all about comfortable footwear when braiding and Crocs is my number one shoe. So yeah, I need to take these out of the car because he asked me how I've been enjoying them and I haven't worn them. They've been in my car for over a week. So yeah, I was about to chow down and forgot to show y'all my food. I didn't get sushi from there today. I got curry based rice. It's like curry chicken, shrimp, pineapples. It's called the pineapple fried rice. So it has scrambled egg, pineapples. It has some raisins in it, which I'm not a fan of. But once you mix it with everything else, you don't really taste the raisins. The curry chicken in there somewhere, but it's really, really good. And then I got shrimp tempura. I have not been able to keep food down for the past few days dealing with my ovarian cysts. So this is my first day really eating food. And yeah, I had to get something filling. Salads and sushi was not going to cut it today. So this is dinner. I'm eating in my room. It's been one of those days. Hey y'all, so it is now Monday, December 5th, and I just finished doing my sister Tan's hair. She got the invisible locks that have been all over social, social media. Um, she asked me for them some weeks ago, and we finally got a chance to do them. It was my very first time doing them, and I feel like I did okay. Um, I just feel like I should have used a little bit more Marley hair to make the twist look a little bit more plump, a little more juicy. But I was scared I was going to make them too bulky. So I was kind of pinching the hair as I went. And it turned out to be a little flatter than I would have liked. But Tan seems to really like her hair. Um, Y'all know with the invisible locks, a lot of people have been flat twisting the person's natural hair. And then feeding in the Marley hair to make it look like the locks are growing out of your scalp. Like they're your locks. So I had to flat twist her hair, which already makes the hairstyle look flat. And then I was just too thin with the pieces. But it turned out all right for my first time. I know next time what I want to do differently. And then now I'm about to go to Angie's. I'm going to run to the hair store because I told y'all I needed some things. Um, it is now Monday and starting Thursday all the way through Christmas. Every other day, sporadically, I spaced them out. But I have some kids booked for Christmas and I need those bows and beads. Um, I went to Beauty Master. I ran in there when I got that jar of BTO, that gold container of stuff. And I told y'all it was out of the mango and lime stuff. They're also out of a lot of red beads and stuff. So I said, uh-uh, we're going to go to Angie's because the beauty master by me, I guess I'm late with the hair bow. So I'm going to go to Angie's. It's also another big franchise here where like beauty master is a super huge like hair store warehouse. Angie's is the same way. The one in my area at least is really big, but I know Angie's is all over Atlanta. So if there's not a beauty master near you and you're in Georgia and you're a braider, definitely check out Angie's as well. Because I'm going there today. I know specifically that they will have this hair that I've been looking for. It's this pre-section hair. My friend Justice brought it to her appointment recently not knowing that it was a hidden gem. And when I seen it, I flipped out. Like now, it's one thing to pre-stretch some hair. But y'all pre-sectioning it too. I have to show it to y'all if y'all haven't seen it yet because it's harder to explain. So once I get it in my hands, I'm going to show y'all. So I'm going to Angie's to get the pre-section hair. The bows and bees, and then I need some more um, shining gem and stuff. So we're about to head out, and then I don't know if the haul is going to be today because I'm tired. I got off at 7 a.m. I crashed for about two hours. Me and Tan came home. We went to work together, came home, took like a two-hour nap on my couch. We just passed out when we walked through the door. Then I started her here at 9. It is now after 3, and I'm tired. So we'll see how the rest of the day goes, but for sure, we're about to go ahead and knock Angie's out because I need stuff. This is Angie's, 
and if you're familiar with Carl Gordon, you'll recognize the front of this building it used to be a grocery store so this hair store is big as hell just imagine how big Kroger is produce bakery grocery all of that and them having a whole hair store built in it so let's go shopping I decided to break my Crocs in today. I'm going to a house call and I thought it would be the perfect time to put on my shoes. Yeah, I wish you could see the fit. This outfit is sending me. It's really the socks. I love the shoe itself. It has great arch support, but <laughs> I should have put on some black socks. This looks crazy. <laughs> For my house call today, my client Brooklyn wanted to try something different. So she checked out this Bobby Boss hair. They now have pre-stretched braiding hair and all kind of textures and curl patterns. This is the King Tips by Bobby Ball. She got the Ocean Wave and a 28 inch, the 1B30, and it was an ombre blend. So it's kind of like the auburn and black towards the top and then a solid auburn towards the end. When I braided it in, I decided to stop where her hair stopped. So I braided it in with the braid and wax, sealed it with nail glue and let the curls do the rest. And it's a really cute hairstyle. I could see this being perfect for the holidays, for her to do different styles, high ponytails, low ponytails, half up, half down, real cute. Hey y'all, so a couple of days have passed in this vlog since y'all have seen my face. But I've been working yesterday, I did. I had two appointments, one was at home. I did those gray and black crochet locks. And then after that, I went to the house call. Y'all remember I had on them ugly socks with them Crocs on. And then I did those, I don't know what you call them, I guess box braids, but she used that um, ocean wave here. So pretty, yesterday was a good day, but I didn't never come back on camera and show y'all that haul from Monday. It's now a couple of days later since I went shopping for the stuff. So I'm gonna show y'all that stuff. And then yeah, we're gonna wrap this vlog up. So I got a bunch of things. Um, a few of the items are in my car. I kept the stuff in my car for travel appointments. This is the stuff I brought upstairs that I know I'm going to need for the clients at home that I'm taking at home. So let me just show y'all everything that's in the bag. First off, I went in there and Angie's just like Beauty Masters always has a self sales paper right at the front of the door so you can grab it as soon as you walk in the door and already know what items are discounted for that day. This is everything they have discounted for the month. So the first thing that caught my eye was all of their rat tail combs was four for a dollar. Normally I pay about 99 cents or I get my combs two for a dollar, but four for a dollar means that all of the combs were a quarter. So I racked up on those as well as the hard brushes. What else was on sale? Oh, all of their mango and lime stuff. I tell y'all in every braider vlog how I've been obsessing over their stuff. All of their stuff was two for one. So buy two, get one free. Their sale is actually beating um, Beauty Master's Christmas sale. So check them out. Let's get into the haul. The first thing that I got, I got a few packs of these. A lot of them are in my trunk. Remember I told y'all that second bag I left in my car. But I did bring this in just to show you guys. I have some knotless appointments. And even though this will only save me a few minutes, every minute counts when you're doing knotless braids. So they now have it where I told y'all 
on Monday, I was looking for this pre-section here that my friend Justice brought in one of her recent appointments. And it's patent, meaning that this is something that um, the Janet Hair Collection has come up with. No other brand of braiding hair has this in the store right now, in the stores right now. So it's pre-sectioned out where instead of, I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. Like it's already sectioned pre-stretched for those of you who are watching my vlog and don't braid pre-stretches when the hair is already stretched out to that point where your braids aren't like just cut straight across but pre-section is when the pieces are already pulled apart for you to just take them out the pack and pull them into the hair sometimes you'll see your braider take a full bundle of hair and have to pull the pieces apart and put them on the rack this hair is already sectioned out all i have to do is pull it from the pack and pull it in my client and put it in my client's hair which like i said it's only gonna save me a couple of minutes because i still have to take the pieces individually out of the packaging but y'all know knotless can be very time consuming it says pick up one by one this is something exciting this is an exciting find and after i use this several times i'm really going to be able to tell y'all if i determine a difference but i don't want them to all fall out but y'all just see how it's already pre-sectioned i don't have to sit there and try to evenly divide all of the pieces all of this is manufactured where it's already pulled apart in even pieces for me so it gives you three bundles like the regular pre-stretch braiding hair except each bundle is already sectioned out for you with these little dividers and all you have to do is pull the pieces apart the way these pieces are sectioned they match my small knotless braid so in order to do any other size i would end up combining the pieces which means i would have to section it out myself anyway i'm messing this all up i have to get it back right on my braiding rack but for my small knotless braids, these are the exact pieces that I would pull. So this will be perfect for small knotless because small knotless take me the longest. And here go my pieces I already made. So I got a bunch of these in 1B and 1. But I brought a lot of green and red stuff. Um, now I will say one pack of beads I just used today. My friend Jelena just left and she brought her youngest daughter, Janai, today to get her hair done. And we did like a little peppermint theme. She got red and white beads. So I used that red pack of beads that I purchased um the smaller ones for her being my toddler i originally brought red and green for her but we went with red and white um, so those were the red beads that i got i also got some other red beads these are larger ones these are for my older girls that are not toddlers but not big enough for we down their back yet and this is for my friend Jelena's oldest daughter Kamaya she has an appointment um y'all probably won't see that in a vlog got those for her they already selected those when um they came for their appointment just now they literally just walked out the house and I was like let me go ahead and do this haul because days are passing by and I'm already digging into stuff that I haven't showed y'all yet but I got a bunch of um green and red stuff i got these metallic bowls um a couple of them have green glitter a couple of them are metallic i got some reds multicolor reds these are the green ones i was telling y'all about the um video i just showed y'all of janai's hair i originally got the red and green for that style that she just got but jelena only went with the red so i have a green pack for another baby um this particular pack i was looking for something identical to this with the red and clears in a pack but they only had the reds by itself so we're just gonna add clear to that but they have a green one with the metallics and the um glitter and i thought this was perfect if i get a girl who's into the green a lot of the moms go with red and golds red and silver but if i do get a mom this week that wants the greens this would be perfect because the beads have the glitter excuse me because the lighting from the ring light is a little off i just felt like this matched up with these bows really really cute for like a um, late elementary schooler, like a fourth or fifth grader, they're gonna set it off for the holidays. And then I got these, they're kind of like two-tone red. So a bunch of these, like I told you, the mango and vine products were buy two, get one free. So these were $8.99 a piece. And then I got the third one free. So I'm good on this for a minute. I got two sets of that. I'm good on wax for the rest of the year. Literally don't have probably through January too because I got six of those. Then I got some black soap. I like to use it on my face. This is the black hemp soap. I've never had the hemp kind. So I got the hemp this time. And then I got a soap dish to put in my shower because my black soap always bleeds. Nothing super special. Just 
this little lavender container. Also for self-care, I got some lotion. I normally wouldn't buy lotion out of the hair store because it's much cheaper in Walmart or Target, but I haven't seen the coconut oil one. This is like $8, it'll be like $5 in Walmart, but your girl be ashy. I was running out of lotion, so I had to get this while I was in there. I'm back to my OG edge control. I got the Sweet Leche, the Extra Hold, um, the Kiss Edge Fixer all-time favorite right here so i'm back on this i've been using recently the edge booster which isn't bad but this just hit different because it has a fragrance to it then like i told y'all all of their tools were marked down four for 99 cents so i got four of these because you know they walk in different colors and then i got a couple of sets of rat tail combs but these are my favorites right here yeah like a rainbow glitter and a purple glitter these were the last two they had left and then i got some solid colors why would i get this round container in this square soap bar but you know once it wear down it'll be able to fit <laughs> i thought i was doing something you gotta head back true yeah i'm good so yeah braiders check out this hair by the janet collection this pre-section hair all you do is just pick it up piece by piece save you some time a lot of distractions in the living room so i had to come to my room to formally close the vlog out like i should yeah i think that's all i wanted to say about angie's it was monday this happened days ago so whatever i was gonna tell y'all listen it's out of my head but that's today's vlog i just wanted to show y'all how the beginning of my december is going with holiday hair appointments it's going to pick up and triple between now and christmas so there may be a second braid of vlog this month i don't know but i hope you all enjoyed what you have seen thus far i love you all and i will see you in the next video